Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. I got an AQ and Studs asked me to duel him, so I figured why not test out Mindbreaker in PvP. Why not? Apparently it's a PvP class. I don't really know how to use it too well. I know your two stacks and that buffs everything else. And my five is probably my kill skill. And we just beat him. But he was an ultra, ultra Omni Knight. And I don't even think he had uh, the amulet on. So, welcome to the video, guys. They were going to be going over the new event and my opinion on it. Let's get into the video. A giveaway going on on the channel. If you're not aware, I'm pretty sure you are. But all you have to do to enter is be subscribed to the channel, leave a like on the video, and comment down below. Um, the giveaway applies to each video after this one, so this one, this one, this one, this one, and any more I upload until TLAPD on September the 16th. That's when the giveaway will end. That's when we'll draw. Actually, we might draw on the 17th. But each comment on each video is another chance to enter. I will be picking one comment from each video and then putting them into a pool. And, that, and then we'll pick a random number from that pool from each video. Alright, so... I want to talk about the event this week's event. I got a lot of comments on my stream and in the VOD of the stream that people didn't like it that much. I think people got stuck. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe people didn't like the event. I don't, I don't Maybe maybe that's a legit response. But there's a bunch of cool items there. I don't, I don't know why people didn't like it. So there's a few house items. Uh, but you do have to finish the quest line to do it. I'm guessing some people didn't finish it maybe. I don't know. Maybe. But at one point in the quest line, you will get stuck, uh, and it doesn't tell you where to go. Uh, it just kind of doesn't let you do the last quest. Uh, so the last quest is in the very far right over here. This is the quest that will finish the story right here, um, right in this room. So this is the last one. Uh, it'll be locked and t until you uh, do this mini game. So after you finish the quest in this room over here uh, for people that uh i've already seen this said so yeah sorry i'm explaining to everyone but uh once you finish the quest in here uh, and then you have to go this way uh it locks the quest in the next one so there's no like quest active they don't really tell you where to go either uh not to my knowledge at least so you have to just go in here and play this mini game um it's pretty easy i think all you have to do is get like a score above 30 or something and then you win uh the game and then you can move on to the next quest and I think a lot of people maybe just thought that the quest in the dragon room was the last one and they didn't play through the event and they didn't get any items maybe not maybe I'm just thinking wrong there but if you did get stuck like I did on the stream uh, then this is how you do it you just randomly click in a circle and you'll finish this it's really not that hard you just spam click and you, you can get a high score like that. Uh, and once you do finish that, it'll say quest complete and it will let you do the quest over in this room. Uh, when you do the quest in that room, you get a house item. Um, it's a 100% drop, I think, from the quest. It's a very cool, very large house item. We'll show you that in a few moments. Uh, and also, once you're done that quest, you can go back to the beginning here. Uh, by the way, the map name is DracoCon. Uh, it's in the bottom corner if you want to join this map if the event isn't currently active. It might be rare. Uh, I don't know if the event's going rare or not. Maybe. Uh, so you can do the quest Treasure Hunt, which has a lot of items. Now, I have some of these items in my inventory. I'll go sh through and show you them. Uh, there's a Zorback Morph and a few other things. So, Zorback Morph looks really nice. I like it. Uh, there's a member version of the helmet and also a non-member version. So, the non-member... Uh, I have my helmet disabled. Um... So the non-member version kind of looks like a classic uh, Zorback, and then this one looks more like the AQW Zorback. And then you can put that with the armor, if I can find it, right there. And then you got a Zorback Morph, which is pretty cool. I like the Twilly Morph, and the Zorback Morph is a, uh, a nice addition. I don't think we've I don't think we've had a Zorback Morph before, but very very nice armor you can get. And also, uh, I kept all the cool looking items of things that I uh, would think people thought were cool. Um, where is it? The Undead Horror Blade. A lot of people like this on the stream for some reason. Uh, that animation is pretty, pretty crisp and kind of, it creeps me out a lot. That animation looks like there's a squid stuck in the blade. <laughs> it's trying to get out. Um, 
But if you want a creepy sword, you can get that from doing this quest. This quest is very easy. Uh, all, all you have to do for this quest is literally just destroy these piles. And the piles have no health. So, very easy quest. And also you can get a house item. So, I think doing this uh, the quest line here, it's a very short quest line here. Um, of course, uh, AQW does weekly releases, so they can't always release um, like the best quest line in the world. Uh, but I think this one's really good, and I think people gave it a lot of undue hate. Um, so it's house items. We rarely get house items. We get them more often than we used to. So this is the one, this house item right here, this is one house item. And this is what you get for finishing the quest line. It's a very, very large house item, uh, but I like it. It's... That's cool. Maybe if I maybe I should get a bigger house, and uh, that would fit more accurately. And it's a pretty laggy item too. And also, well, that's not that's not a house item, but you get this from doing the treasure chest quest, which I thought was pretty cute. And it, it looks like he's singing to him. And yeah, I set it up like that. So there's two house items there that you can get. And uh, yeah, I like the quest line. It was a good quest line. If you want to play through it, it is currently active, or you can slash join Draco Con. And that will bring you to it. And there's a bunch of cool items you get there, including a Zorback Morph. And there's also a few other blades and stuff that I didn't really think were that nice. So I just left them. Um, and also there's a few pets, but the pets are member only. I can show you a few of them here. Uh, the Ruby and the Sapphire Gem. Those are both member only, but if you want them, uh, they're there. So, thanks for watching the video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I just wanted to show people that didn't play the event already or got stuck in the event this video so they would... Uh, figure out how to finish it and or play it if they have not already. I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace. Click the video in the top right corner if you haven't seen it yet. And I'll see you all in the next one.